Okay, so it's Sunday morning. I'm sitting here having my, my morning Sunday coffee. I'm about done with it. And look at that sun. It keeps getting closer and closer. Remember in the movie Interview with a Vampire and Claudia and that lady were down the well and that sun kept getting closer and closer. That's how I feel this morning. I don't want that sun to touch me because it's pretty hot out here, but if the sun touched me, it'll be too hot. So I'm feeling like a vampire on this Sunday morning. I may have to move out back. Look how pretty that is. I'm getting ready to eat some watermelon and cherries out here. Um, I'm, I'm being good today. Some days I can do Weight Watchers, some days I can't. But all this, this is free points right there. Y'all, how come all the cats always know to come to my house? This ain't my cat. I'm just out here trying to enjoy my my evening. This is the one I call Socks. He, he, he headbutts me and stuff. Here he comes. He's a good boy. Alright. Get over there so I can film you. Look at him. Look how pretty he is. He gets on my last nerve though. I know that. I would just sitting up here with my phone watching YouTube being comfortable. And here he comes. Uh-huh. All right. Go back on the table. Go back on the table. Oh, it looks sad because I won't... I've been loving on him. I don't know why he won't quit. Look at him. He's precious, isn't he? He's not even mine. I swear. Look how pretty they are in bloom. Isn't that pretty? Look at that one. That one's perfect. No holes or anything. Okay, it's getting ready to rain, but I didn't know. Look how big my impatience are getting. Um, I didn't know if, uh, here's the four o'clocks with the big fat June bug on it. But other than that, it's not too bad. Um, but anyway, there's the four o'clocks. They're pretty, aren't they? And that had to make a liar out of me because I said I never get any blooms out of it. I still got some blooms on that. But I just wanted to show you the onions. I think this is it. I think this is their... Um, I stick them up in the fence to make them... Well, those are drooping down a little bit. But I think that's it. I think that's their... Uh, it's raining. Which we need it really, really bad look my first little blooms when they start blooming the other ones quit over over by the pond so and then this big hosta right there is blooming yay it's finally raining we really really needed it y'all probably had 100 degree weather just like we have i think it's been hot the whole the whole country's been hot <clears throat> um but we're finally just it's just sprinkling I didn't I watered my look, look at that big hole I don't know what happened to that plant it just died and I got mad and <laughs> look it's up in the alley now I just pulled it up through it I have to go uh, clean Christy's house tomorrow anyway so um, I'll stop at Walmart and get something to put in that hole I might I don't know I don't know um you know, the cannas will come back every year. The um, daisies will come back every year. Hopefully that rose will come back next year. This little orange one won't. But I don't know if I could... Uh, I'd like to get maybe something that comes back every year, but I don't want it to take over the, um, the daisy. <gasps> Actually, I'd like to have like maybe a different kind of daisy, like a black-eyed Susan or... I saw some real pretty wild daisies on the side of the road. Um, me and Scotty were over in Ohio, which is just, you know, a couple blocks. Um, we was over in Ohio today, and I saw some beautiful orange daisies growing by the side of the, the road. Then I started putting my vines up like that. Can you see where I put it up there? I thought maybe it could block the view on that side just a little bit, you know. I'm not complaining. I'm not complaining. I really am complaining. But <laughs> so, 
That new flocks is doing pretty good. I'm going to deadhead it. I looked online and it said if you deadhead these flocks that they'll give you blooms till October. So we'll have to see. Um, I didn't kill my rose bush after all. It, it came back. It's got a lot of new growth and it's got new little buds and stuff on it. I, I imagine it would have been beautiful if I hadn't well this one's just got a lot of bunch of dead roses on it but it's got lots of new growth see that that purple kind of growth that's new isn't it so I didn't I didn't kill my roses that's nice and then uh, the canna let me get over here the canna came up pretty good she's pretty tall she the top leaf is broke but that's that's all right mm. let's see i still haven't mowed the grass you can see i just did that one strip i don't care um look how brown it is though where i have mowed grass you know it's just well look how brown that grass is all kinds of spots of brown because it's just been so dry and so hot and then my um my elephant ears are doing okay, too. Honey, you can get on my porch. That, that little cat right there is mad at me. Because he wasn't fixed before, and he was, ugh, oh, a demon. But now he's fixed. I don't mind him hanging out. He was just so mean before. But this, this is what made me pull my camera out when I, I came out here, and I thought, oh, my God. Beautiful, beautiful. So, I know I've said this before. I can't wait till next year when that one's big too. I was thinking I'm gonna dig this one up this year and um, transport, transplant part of it somewhere else. Um, I have never dug it up since I planted it here, and it's been here about six, six years now or something. So it needs to be probably divided and stuff. If y'all live close, I give you a piece. Uh, anyway, it's raining. Yay, look, it's raining. We need this so bad. I wish it had a thunderstorm. You know I love a good thunderstorm. And I was hoping that the wind would blow real good so I could hear my new little wind chimes. I had, well, this used to be the best one I had. It's okay. But listen to this one. And then the, I want the great, great big one. And then I got this little wooden one. But I want the big wooden one too. Then I had these two little, my, um, what's her name? Um, Ladybug. And then the one next to it is a dragonfly. So that's the light, the little light noise, you know. But I like the deeper, deeper tones of the big ones. Okay, well. Yay, we needed this rain.